Lulu Farm Guy here with new mod test for Monday, November the 14th. And this is Slated Cow Shed by Sully. 15.96 megabytes to download, 19 slots on console. And this uh, cow shed can be found under animals and cows. And there it is, $100,000. It will hold 100 cows. It has automatic lighting, as you can see. We're going to... We're going to take a quick look around. Uh, does it have... No, it doesn't have any alternate styles or anything like that. Uh, daily upkeep. Water automatically full. Lights automatically turn on at night. $55 a day for upkeep. So we have some. Uh, we have gates that open up here. And close that. Does this one open? Open gate. There we go. That one opens like so. Uh, slurry trigger here. The uh, milk is here. The animal dialogue here. And open gate. We have to get. You have to get really close like basically right there to open and close the gates. Now, <clears throat> I could not get straw bales to be accepted here, so it will not take bales for straw. As you can see, not, nada, nilch. Nilch, that's a new word. Um, cows are nicely animated. The straw does appear in the floor. The food does appear here. Now, I have filled them both to capacity and went ahead the one month or the one sleep. Uh, capacities are food is uh, 33,750 and straw is 16,000 liters. Now, if we go take a look at our cowsies, uh, the food has run out. So, yeah, you can't put enough food in there for them to survive the month. Uh, food goes in quite nicely actually. It doesn't take, uh, it's not, there is an overhang as you can see here, but the trigger actually is pretty generous where you don't have to go underneath to unload. So the food did run out if we look back in there, straw, there's still 6,400 liters of straw, so that's not too bad. Although you can't, well, if you want to use bales, you'll have to go and uh, shred them, use a bale shredder or something. As for the straw, loose straw, it will take loose straw. And this one, for some reason, it's a little bit closer, and if we... I did get it in here with this there. Uh, you have to be a little bit. It's just right on the, come on, there it is. So you're just underneath that overhang for the straw trigger to come up. And uh, that's where the straw goes in. Now, uh, manure. Yes, it does uh, produce manure. I have the manure silo here. And as you can see, we have manure, so very good there. <clears throat> uh, turn that light off. And so, capacities for milk. So it looks like we're about 30,000 liters of milk, probably. As I can tell, 11.6 11, 11, where it is at now, it's about a third. And slurry's at about a quarter there, so... Maybe a little less than a quarter, 25. So I'm not going to run it all the way to the end um, as it's not even close to being full after a month of operation. But we were going to check out the... Um, <clears throat> make sure the triggers work for unloading or loading of said slurry and milk products. As we come up, start filling very quickly. Slurries filling very quickly as well. So that's good. If we hop back over to our other tanker, 
We're going to zip over to the uh, milk trigger and open up our tank and we should be seeing the milk trigger start filling right away there it is and fairly quickly too so not too bad <clears throat> i do like having the the milk trigger on the opposite end of the sl uh, as the slurry um yeah it's just nice when they're separate that you can't you don't get them mixed up or sideways or whatever as you can see the food appears here when full the straw appears over here and over here so unfortunately uh, you won't be able to keep enough food in there for them to survive a month without uh, adding extra food unfortunately so hopefully that gets an update uh, to increase the capacity of the food capacity that would be nice um, not sure how much food they would actually eat in a month because it ran out so I really don't know but there you go that's the slated cow shed by Sully 15.96 megabytes to download 19 slots on console thank you for watching I'm Looney Farm Guy and remember it's only a game so till next time bye for now Thank you.